please copy. Oh my god, what? Uh, Shaw. And then we're gonna go here. And we're gonna go. And then we're gonna go studio mode. And then we're gonna go in game. Grand finals in session. And now we're gonna do weekly, or not weekly, round grand finals. And let's go into this. So we're going to grand finals here. We're seeing the Toon Link from Brisket instead of the Young Link. Uh, we're seeing Xander get very excited for that. Uh, the distance is being established here. Toon Link does have the advantage of just doing, uh, like the thing with Toon Link is Toon Link's damage output and, and like close range moves are actually very good. I Arguably better than uh, Toon Link or Young Link's. Another thing that's really good about Young Link or Toon Link is that throw game. You see that back throw. That back throw is a great kill throw. Better than the forward throw by a long shot. It's one of the strongest back throws in the game behind like Ness and some other ones. And uh, there you go, getting back on stage. Getting that fair. Oh, going? That was actually really smart, because I was like, oh, why didn't you follow up that? And it was because I'm too used to watching uh, Young Link play. But also because the, the arrow was there was to cover the, the neutral air dodge, and it kind of forced Sean in an awkward position. Um, well, it wasn't meant to cover the air dodge, but it, it did put Sean in a position where like Sean had the air dodge, and the after air dodge got hit. And oh my god, building up damage like crazy. Brisket already took a stock, by the way. I am... Brisket is on a blood path right now. The war path, I'm telling you, of a bracket that sh that uh, Brisket has been through. This is this is a the score esports worthy video if uh, Brisket wins this. And there you go. Oh, getting hit by that there by the bomb there. And oh, still just like zaring or uh, zaring about up throw. Uh, yeah, throwing that out. And there you go, catching the roll read. Just like you force Shaw to make an option by doing that. You push on a timer, and when you put somebody on a timer, they're kind of forced, they, they, they kind of get nervous and do an option they don't want to, which is what Brisket uh, made Shaw do, which is very good. Very good play from Brisket. Now Shaw, having Brisket off stage and getting that second bear, taking that first stock, but Shaw's on their last. This is not looking good for Shaw. Oh my God, and taking taking so much damage. That was a nice crisp 44. Oh, the, the bomb was dropped by the parry which did not allow Brisket to extend the combo further because I think the bomb would have actually been a very good tool there. Very smart from, uh, uh, oh, there you go. Getting hit by the bomb. Mm -hmm. Throwing the bomb. And then th yeah, just keeping distance. You can't allow Shaw to get in and get that damage, especially with the deficit Shaw is at. You don't want Shaw to be able to get the ability to make it back. So you're just kind of building advantage here and it's working great for Brisket. But Shaw is just like, come on, ba -ba -bam, I'm coming in. There you go, getting the projectile there. Uh, Shaw getting the projectile there. Yeah, still still playing a character with a tether. Very important in this matchup. Because now you can't get cheesed as easily. And you can't even get a uh, ledge, or uh, not ledge, uh, yeah, uh, ledge trapped as easily. It's much diff more difficult. Off stage. Oh, the bomb there, perfectly covering. Oh, trying to get the spike there, but it did not end up hitting. Going for the up air. The up air also not hitting. In a weird spot. Ooh, there you go, getting the nair. Oh, yeah, the dare just like not doing anything for uh for oh there you go, brisket. But brisket just gets right under there. Whoop him! Up smash, taking game one there. So let's change our right score to one. That's a pig. It's a little piggy. Little piggy. Oh my god. Alright, what stage are we going to next? Are we seeing a little switch or like what up? Honestly, I have not seen Town and City all day, so I would like to see some nice, yummy, delicious, juicy Town and City. Yeah, man. Redinja. <sighs> Lucas. Tyler picking on a win? Come on. Mods. <laughs> Tio, get this guy. Get this, get this person out of here. Get him out of here. Alright, we have Brisket. Oh my god. So we're gonna go with the, the switch to Ness, which is interesting because uh, the the Toon Link did perfectly well. You know, I just think Brisket's here for a fun time, and also I have noticed a pattern. I have seen all the characters have tether recoveries. The only character I've seen there I've seen two characters Brisket has played three actually, so it's even. But I'm surprised there are, there's way more characters that don't have a tether compared to characters that do have a tether in this game. So. It's a weird thing, but you know what? Tether's really good because it it shortcuts recovery a lot of times. There's a whole area where you're better off tethering, 
especially as a character like Lucas, you don't want er, all the characters that have been played. Sometimes you don't want to recover like normally with the option of tethering because it's so good. Oh uh, yeah, that's not dead though. Yeah, there like you can like net if uh, if Shaw got the right angle there, Frisky was dead. But like realistically to get it, uh, Shaw would have probably had to die as a result. And Shaw's at quite a big advantage, so there's no reason to. And uh, speaking, like, yeah, to mention that, literally has double the percent, uh, uh, half the percent that Brisket has. Never mind. Uh, immediately getting hit by something. Ooh, getting killed there. Oh, my God. Brisket just turning the tides so quickly. It was 65 to 130, and then it was dead to 130. So, there you go. Getting the fair, though. So now it's even. Dead to dead. Or alive to alive in this case. If A implies B, and they're both false, it's still true. Yeah. Oh, there you go. Sorry, I'm, I'm speed, speaking my 130, math 135 uh, wisdom. There you go. Getting that, not going for the back air. I thought that would, that would be great pressure, but it's still working. Oh, Shaw's in a rough spot. Getting spiked. Still alive, though. That Greninja recovery, it's so stubborn. It just won't allow you to die there. And uh, we're seeing uh, Brisket just living on with 0%, living their best life. Meanwhile, Shaw at 84. Like, the, the percentage keeps building up. There you go, the fair. There you go. Oh my god, the double? The triple. That was such good damage. The back air. Oh, the second back air. Nearly getting the kill. What's up, work out for this? Oh my god. Oh, the, there you go, the nair. Yeah, just slowly, just playing giga, giga patient. You, you love to see it. the forward throw away. Trying to get back to stage. Ooh, getting a hit there. That sucks. Dude. That looks painful. And there you go. Okay. There you go. Going in. Oh my god. Getting the hits there. He's getting fire. No. Yeah, just. We're seeing Shaw just trying to space out uh, Brisky here. Getting those. Trying to get that kill. Because 101% against Shaw's. Ooh, no. Oh, still alive, but. I mean, having jump, perfect conservation of jump there. Because definitely would have been dead if, if uh, he didn't have it. Uh, but we're seeing we're seeing Brisket in such an advantageous position here. 74% uh, on Shaw's last stock compared to Brisket's 116 on their second. It's uh, it's a little bit rough here. It looks like Brisket is, is on track to get this bracket reset. But uh, I should not speak too soon. You never know what Shaw got on him. Yeah, getting the PK fire there, just playing so passive. Just like, I have this amazing projectile that hits so far and also kills. You love to see it. First get taking game two there. Yeah! He just like pulls the key out from the ground. I have discovered it all. Uh, the posters that you printed from Staples. All right, we're going into game three. Brisket up 2-0 here, and Brisket switching back to the tune lane. Brisket just like messing around, having a great time. You know what I mean? And there you go. Ooh. Yeah, getting the up smash. Uh. Yeah, there you go. Oh, okay. There you go. Just slowly pushing in. You love it. Like, it's it's really just like a keep away game. It's like you're holding the sacred art. It's like literally like a game of tag. You're it. And uh, Brisket's been winning. Because, you know, playing a little child that loves to run away. Literally all the characters have been children that like to run away. Toon Link, Young Link, and Lucas are all annoying pieces of garbage. I'm kidding. They're probably nice. They seem a little bratty. Actually, Lucas just looks sad. I haven't played Mother 3. Probably should. I should probably play... Do I want to play Earthbound? No. Mother 3, though. Because there's, like, the, the mystique around it. Oh, my God. The perfect recovery. There you go. The up air. Okay. Oh, yeah. The passive play there was really good, but sadly not being able to get anything off of it. Because, uh... You just want it, like, I think Shaw was expecting Brisket, because at this percent, uh, up smash is a big threat. 
to see if uh, Brisket was going to do something, but no, Brisket did not do end up doing anything there. So, or ended up just jumping away. So, and Crisis averted. Oh, barely dodging the up air there. And uh, Shaw is just like trying to take this stock. Like, it, it's too, the stocks have been very stubborn today. It's very, yeah, there you go. Oh, there you go, in the fair. Oh, the, the stream lag, stream lag, what the hell? <laughs> Heck, sorry. Get up here, no. Down smash. Uh, there you go, getting, oh, getting the fair there, that was a big. Oh, getting the side B. And uh, that was crazy. that was amazing. Okay, but still, Shaw's at 95% on second stock. Yeah, yep, literally just wait it. Literally no, no, nothing to worry about there. I perfectly understand. Yeah, there you go. This could just like I'm gonna pummel and I'm gonna wait for that that boom to come back. Oh my god. Oh, if that if the, if the up air was there, if there was an up air, oh brother. Oh my god, I would have been like I would have flatlined. It would have been so cool. But if like if if Shaw got killed there, oh my god. But now it's just like, man. Like I just imagine like Shaw's just like please. Let me in. It's like that one Eric Andre thing. Let me in. Ah, let me in. There you go. We're talking about academics over there. Oh, there you go. Getting the fair. Brisket is just chilling here. Oh, there you go. Mm. There you go. Oh, okay, the bomb. To yeah, there you go. Keep up, keep up the pressure here, literally. Yeah, there you go. Hmm? We're keeping up pressure here. Oh, there you go. Oh, that was a really good parry. But not being able to play off of it very well. And uh, now we're having Brisket just like continue to. Oh, starting to go in a little, honestly. Just playing tricky now. There you go. Brisket recognizes they have a lot of resources. Well, to be fair, like Shaw isn't that far. Yeah, 58% getting the stock there. That's actually. Shaw is could potentially win this. But if, uh, if Shaw loses this, then Brisket does get the bracket reset. Which honestly, like for Shaw, the current situation, it doesn't matter too much. It just means Shaw is closer to death. Which is. Uh, or closer to losing the bracket, but with the way Brisket's been playing, like this is uh, this is Brisket set so far. Oh my god! Like even with the bomb shenanigans there, like yeah, you caught it, but you still got blown up. Just not confirmed into. Oh my god! Oh the drag down, not hitting. There you go. Yeah. Oh yeah. There you go. The bomb, the Z drop into uh, Nair. Perfect amount of or great damage. There you go. Just like oh, okay, grabbing the bomb again. No, just like have to keep relying on random things to hit. Oh, mm. okay, there you go. Off stage. No, I'm gonna get back. Oh, okay. Actually, it's so it's so close. Shaw could win this. Oh, Shaw got got. Uh, yeah, having jump still though, cause it cause you touched the platform. Oh no, this is this is very worrisome for Brisket. Cause or very, this is very like, ooh, going for that was honestly, if that hit, that would have definitely killed. Cause it, it always sends in front of. The angle. And there you go, Shaw taking a game, still in this race here, for this first set. Okay, I'm like, I, I'm, I'm feeling the crazy. Like. Ba ba ba, we're going in. Game four, Greninja versus Lucas. Literally just switching around characters, having fun. Brisket is like giddy right now with joy. And I, I just like, I just think it's so funny because Brisket's like, yay. And then everybody else is like, please, I want to win. And Riz is like, I don't care about this game competitively anymore. Like, I, like, I'm here to have fun. And I'm in grand finals. 
And I'm about to make the bracket reset. Don't you love Smash Bros? Just such a silly, goofy game with so many like 90 silly, goofy guys and a lot more silly, goofy players like Brisket. And there we go, getting the dash attack. Oh, there we go. Okay, get in the back here. Okay, getting back on stage there. Okay, so now we're we're seeing. Oh my God, we just saw. Oh my God. That was such a good play from Shot. You force, you like pressure Brisket, so Brisket can't get any closer, and then you just recover. And because you recover, and there's no space for Brisket to be, Brisket just dies. Like a genius play by Shaw there. I won't even cap. Not even a little. There we go. Oh, there. Okay, that was a really good uh, side view. There you go. PK fire. PK fire. There you go. Just continuously going in, getting like. Just trying to get that, because the second that hits, that goes off stage, and you're just chilling. You're just like in a really good spot here. Uh, oh, okay, no, not getting the the fair. Yeah, there you go. Just slowly chipping away at some good damage, and then, yeah. Oh, barely not getting hit by that. Shaw is playing very smooth around Brisket's plays or Brisket's PK fires, because like, yeah, in this scenario, Brisket is 100% like right to use PK fire. But now it's just like Shaw is per, per, like expecting it, and because he's expecting it, it's just like a lot more. Uh, it's a lot more difficult to get killed. But speaking of, the Brisket just got an up throw kill, uh, and uh, Shaw is Shaw is looking pretty confident in this game so far. Uh, oh, is about to get that fair, and that fair would have dealt some pretty good damage. Oh no, getting the grab there, not being able to play off of it though, surprisingly, because uh, what's it called? Have, uh, Brisket has re, re or Lucas has really good uh, grab combos. Just like Lu Lucas is like a pseudo grappler in this game, so like having multiple kill throws is one thing. There you go. Okay, there we go. Okay, so we're PK fire, PK fire. Oh, okay, back throw, boom. Okay. Oh, the down smash? No, getting back thrown. And, uh, yeah, making it back. Perfect. Barely making it back in time. Okay. Oh, yeah, getting hit by that there. Okay, the up throw maybe? Yeah. Oh, not. Oh, it does kill. Okay. So, Brisket's on the last stock here, and if Brisket loses this, then it goes to game five, where Shaw could 100% win this, this turn off of that. So, Br like, tensions are high, because you don't want to get to that position. Like, because... Then it's a, it's, a, it's a reverse 3 go as well. So it's like, you got styled on, which is something you don't want to see. Because Brisket was playing, has been playing very well, but uh, Shaw, Shaw has just like picked up like picked up the scraps and was like, I'm going, I'm going in. Uh, off stage though. So let's see if, uh, oh, that was a really good uh, water shuriken because it stopped uh, Brisket's PK fire, like clashing with it, which is how, ooh, there you go. Predicting the fact that uh, Brisket would go for a down smash there and using the up B to dodge it. Oh no! Oh, spot dodging the grab off stage. Oh, what? Um, what's it called? Using your upbeat to get out of the way of that. Oh, trying to PK freeze. Brisket's trying to pull out all the uh, all the stuff in the toolbox. Oh my God! That was such a good play. Running straight around and getting the grab. Expect a shot. Expecting some type of like some type of move, but no. That was just the grab. Now let's see. Uh, is, Brisket is looking to close this game out, but it's looking kind of hard. 100 percent. Versus zero percent, it's very possible, but it will be against all the odds. And there we go, even farther off stage. Now having to get back to stage here. Meanwhile, Shaw is just ledge trapping. Just like I am not gonna try and go off stage against you. I know you are Lucas. I know you have the cheese. Like, up, like there's so many things that could have happened off stage. Not getting hit by the sh water shuriken. That water shuriken has been doing Shaw very dirty. Not being able to close out games when he needs them to. But Brisket is still in this, keeping the distance, getting in, getting the fair. But shot, like still, like they're just trading hits here, which is and there you go, getting the fair. Brisket is still alive. It, it, oh my god, yeah, tethering straight back to ledge, having to try and get back uh, to some center stage. You're not trying to die anything. Falling out of the water shuriken again. Literally, if Shaw loses this game, it is all water shuriken. Getting the shadow sneak to take game four. It is currently two two. We're going to game five, grand finals. If Brisket wins this. 
Brisket does get the bracket reset, and we are st and we are playing another set. If Shaw wins this, Shaw is the, uh, the Fall 2023 U Waterloo Smash Week Two champion or winner. So <coughs> tensions are high, you know. Tensions are rising. Tea time, tea time, tea time, tea time. Da 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 da. Drake Utopia again. Kalos, I love this stage. I love Kalos. Kalos made me like, oh, oh, and they're like, oh, he's dancing. He's dancing. I'm not dancing. I oh, actually, I'm, I'm shimmying. I'm shimmying. Three, what? 3v3? At 10, 47? How many people are you looking? What do you got? Okay. All right, we're going in. I went into game five here. We're just, oh, we're seeing the tune link now. Okay, we're seeing, we're seeing all the options brought out. So, uh, I believe this was brought out in the last, in their first set, and uh, Shaw was able to beat it. But I think, uh, you know, I think Brisket's just here to have a good time. But as well as just keep uh, throwing uh, Shaw off. Because Shaw was getting very used to the way Brisket was playing, uh, what's it called, Lucas at the end. You could tell with by, like some of the, the plays Shaw was making. Shaw was trying to cheese there. I saw that. Trying to use, uh, trying to use up B. But yeah, uh, basically what, uh, what Brisket is doing, or what Brisket is doing is trying to keep Shaw on, their on his toes. Because last game we saw the adaptations to the Lucas really far into effect, and I think that's what really allowed Shaw to win that game. Just being like, I know you're gonna do this because you've been doing it this whole set, or this whole match. So, and and I feel like Brisket recognized if I did Toon Link as well there, you would have just done the same thing. So I, it's time to switch it up, as well as the fact that the Toon Link also lost. So I think uh, I'm surprised we're not seeing the Yoshi, but you know what? I won't ask questions. I'm not the player here. There you go. Oh, getting back up. Get in the back here. Yeah, there you go. Just using that to stall. Honestly, it's such a good. Oh, and I think and Brisket's still alive. Wow. Uh, they both tech there though, which is uh, save. Uh, oh, save shot from taking a lot of damage. Now we have, uh, but we do have Brisket with a quite a lead, a whole stock in fact. Uh, but at 130, so is prone to dying very soon. Uh. It just depends on, like, oh, yeah, the bomb blew up right as it happened, but, like, shot, or, but, first it was just able to get back, and, yeah, there you go, that's a really good pressure, oh, my God, the pressure is, like, it's, like, small hits, but they, they really, like, do a lot, and there you go, Shaw finally taking that first stock, but at 120, Brisket is very close to taking it, and, yeah, that was a really good bomb to cover uh, themselves with, and, yeah, the, uh, er, Air Dodging White just sticking the, sticking the ledge there, yeah, trying to, Trying to force Brisket into a position where they they are at a disadvantage by using the the up B. So, uh, but it's it's not working currently. There you go, getting the back air. Oh yeah, and there you go. That's the downer taking the stock there. Uh, Shaw on their last stock. If they lose this stock, it will be a grant uh, a bracket reset. However, uh, and Brisket is quite a stock up, but we have seen uh, Shaw be able to make these back before. So let's see if it happens again. But also, but also, oh, is that dead? No, barely able to make it back. Just hugging the wall there, just like I am. Please hold on to me. I don't want to die yet. <laughs> I don't want to die. Oh, there you go. Getting hit, yeah, getting hit by that, like a lot of damage there. Starting, trying to close in the range. Risk is like, I'm just gonna slowly camp and get some, get some rack up percent. Make it so all of my moves kill you soon. Cause I know you're trying to get those, those hits in to make it so we're like evened up now. So I'm just gonna, widen our gap and by widening our gap it's going to be so much harder for you to win this i want this bracket reset and there you go oh my god shaw getting the air dodge reading being able to get the kill now it is last stock of game five here if shaw wins this the tournament is over but if brisket wins this we get a bracket reset game five so we're seeing okay yeah getting the getting the bear Get in the down tilt, not being able to get a confirm off of it. But oh, Brisket went way high up. I think that was from the uh, from the water gun. I'm not too sure. Or from the I don't think it's water. The drag down. No, not being able to get the drag down. But getting another one. There you go. Getting the F tilt. Oh, trying to go for the shadow sneak. It doesn't work. Off stage now. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Using that. Getting the back air. Using the wall. Okay. Get another back air. Using the projectile to stop the bomb. Okay. It's back to neutral. Yeah, using water shrink, chipping through. Br oh, brisket barely air dodging through a fair that would have 100% killed at the position and percent they were at. Oh, getting the the boomerang, 
It's back to neutral here. Anybody, like one opening and either of these two could be dead here. It is very risky. Being at 100%. Oh, okay, getting the fair there. Oh, the bomb. Saving Brisket there. Literally perfect. Brisket's been using the bomb so well. Shaw getting Brisket off stage. Using Water Shuriken. Playing really patient. Has to be aware of the bomb. The bomb blows up in Brisket's face. Shaw just slowly can't, like, keeping distance. Like, you're gonna fall. You're, like, oh, getting hit by the projectile there. Oh, getting hit again. The bomb. Watching out for the bomb. Watching out for the, literally dodging everything with expert efficient like a ninja. Getting, oh my god, perfectly spacing the fair so uh, Brisket can't space it. Brisket just trying to get something to get a kill here. Both of them are just edging for this kill, and they're just getting so close. Oh my god, just slowly chipping away at each other with projectiles, hoping that one person will get a hit that will end this game. And they are both, oh no, the bo oh, th the boomerang barely saved, um, barely saved Shaw there from getting hit by the arrow. Oh, there you go. Is that it? That is the tournament. That is it. Game five. Our winner is Shaw.